Operation Fatherhood here, back with another video to build up my fellow fathers and the next generation. Remember, I need you to like, subscribe, share, and leave a comment, as my goal is to continue to build this channel for fellow fathers everywhere. Okay, so let's talk about this. I actually had been listening to a number of other views, you know, from brothers everywhere, and sometimes ladies, when it comes to prenups and just divorces in general, right? It seems without nonstop on TikTok and YouTube, I'm always seeing the debate going on between men and women. Uh, sometimes if I'm following certain uh, black channels, quote unquote, uh, they'll be dealing with, you know, the debate between black men and black women. Why can't we date? Why can't we be together and all this kind of stuff? And I might touch on this a number of times because I've seen a couple different things that I found very interesting that I think that I'm not saying I think others miss because I don't think I'm just so enlightened, but I, I don't hear as many people talk about it. So I'm going to touch on that another time, though, you know, or multiple things is uh, from what I've seen anyway. But what I want to talk about in this one real quick is the need or prenups in the time in which we live. If you saw my recent um, YouTube short, and also, you know, I post on TikTok about the need for prenups, then you're going to kind of get an idea of what I'm about to say briefly, which is, which is prenups are needed in a time in which we live because, if for no other reason, the person that you marry, how they reveal themselves, how they portray themselves, whatever, you know, words you want to use in the beginning and what they may say they believe in the beginning may not always be what they actually believe in the end. So if you've seen my videos before my channel, check out, you know, I got a bunch of them from 2022 to uh, this year. Um, but I've talked about video, you know, not videos, but talked about divorce before. I had the uh, unlucky time in my life where I had to go through a divorce back in 2021 and it was something that I didn't want right it was um it was not enjoyable it was not fun and I was probably one of the more fortunate people that I've crossed paths with where I didn't have a lot to give and you know she you know had more technically and she really wasn't taking a lot from me um biggest thing was just you know giving child support the thing I came to come to the real realization of though is when it comes to prenups, it actually kind of protects you, protects you and others, but protects you from that person changing, right? Uh, and I don't mean protecting you from their actually changing, right? You know, we all, we're all going to change to some degree, but it protects you that in the time that they do change, right? They, they change mentally, emotionally, psychologically, spiritually, physically, whatever it is, right? They cheat on you or whatever it is. Even if they do, you still can be covered. It's almost like having an insurance for basically somebody saying, man, forget them vows. So when they say forget them vows, it still protects you from when they decide to forget them. Something to think about. 